Open container areas where people can walk from bar to bar with a drink are officially coming to Ohio. But where those areas will be still up for debate. News Channel 5's Home of Bash is in one spot tonight where the open container area is a possibility. That is Cedar Lee in Cleveland Heights. There are about a dozen bars and restaurants behind me, but traffic on Lee Road flows all day and all night long. So while many of these owners are pushing for this to become an open container area, there are some that are saying, no way, this is just way too unsafe. The buzz of people in the Cedar Lee District on a Friday night, nothing new. But what happens if you add alcohol free flowing out onto the streets to that mix? Right now, it's such new legislation, we're uncertain. How it's going to play out. At first, Ohio's new open container law was for cities with populations over 50,000. So Cleveland Heights, with just over 45,000, didn't qualify. Now it does, and bar owners here want to take a hard look at turning this into more of a hot spot. Cleveland Heights is a great community, and to keep people in this community and not, say, go to other areas. But for John Zagara, president of the Cedar Lee Special Improvement District, the cocktail of heavy traffic and liquor seems a little too unsafe. You're dealing with a lot of activity, with a lot of people, late at night, dark conditions, and maybe more than intoxicated. Which is why bar and restaurant owners here say they have a little more planning to do before any of this becomes reality. Comes with responsibility if people, you know, approach it like grown-ups uh, and don't act like children, then I think it'll end up being...